the Super Bowl. Most never get to live that dream, but the players on display today are so close, they can taste it. First and ten Steelers, the give to the bus off the right side. The bus is gone! Touchdown, New England! Here they come. He's hit it sick! 35, 30, 25, 20, going all the way! Touchdown, Pittsburgh! The Pittsburgh Steelers are no strangers to postseason glory. The terrible towels signal the charge as Bill Cowher has his team primed for a run at a fifth Super Bowl title. Last week, they dismantled the defending champion, dominating with power and speed worthy of the Steelers of old. Throws it down the field. Pucks is open. He's got it. He's into the end zone for the Steeler touchdown. The New England Patriots' magical season survived the winter wonderland that was Foxborough last week. Trailing late, the Patriots fought both the Raiders and the Elements, led by quarterback Tom Brady. And a call steeped in controversy set a sixth-year kicker center stage. Kick is up. We're going to the AFC Championship game. Two AFC teams remain, but only one can survive. The Patriots, the Steelers, the AFC Championship game is next. for AFC supremacy so hotly contested these last two weeks will be decided here today. From Heinz Field for the AFC Championship, the New England Patriots and the Pittsburgh Steelers. In its inaugural season, Heinz Field is extended to the limit. Its inhabitants have waved the terrible towels in triumph and have basked in the glow of a glorious Steeler run. And now the intruders from New England present the final hurdle. This for the first play. Brady pulls it down and goes down. Move back about three feet because Watch Brady out. hits you. Stewart, the screen on first down. Bettis, Bettis on the move. And Bettis out across the 35-yard line. It's out of the shotgun, and here comes the blitz. Gets it away, passes incomplete through the hands of Chris Poole. They come, just letting it go. Another blitz. This time, Brady pulls it down and then falls at the 36-yard line, so he picked it up now on second and 13. Stewart fakes the pass, almost gets wrapped up in his own end zone and makes it out to about the two or three-yard line. Let's see how Miller does with this one. Down the middle. Troy Brown from the 45. To the 40. To the 30. Brown to the 15. To the 5. Touchdown! Bill Cowher, they've been kicking to the sidelines. The kick before was to the sidelines. They kick it right down the middle. They give all the options to Troy Brown and to the New England Patriots, and they take advantage of it. Right down the middle, watch Troy Brown. Little hesitation, and then right up the middle, and such a big hole. Nice job of just staying out of the way of the tackles. Good blocking downfield. Boy, Terrell Buckley, terrific job of blocking, and... That's what they wanted. A special teams scoring opportunity. They got it. And it's good. Bill Cower could not have been more explicit. We don't want Troy Brown bringing punts back right up the middle. He did. Stewart, under pressure, gets away right up the middle to the 40, 45, midfield, and one man to beat. Can't beat Otis Smith, and he's run out of bounds. Another blitz. From shotgun on third and five. The pass is complete inside the 30, inside the 25 to Bobby Shaw. And the fake, the pass out to the side. That's complete to the tight end. Pushing and pushing inside the 15-yard line. Steelers trail by seven, but they're on the move. That's the end of one. New England seven. The Steelers nothing, and we're coming back to Heinz Field for more right after this. have been outstanding in the red zone defensively as Stewart dancing around and goes down at the 11-yard line. As far as the wind is concerned, from 30 yards out, he hit that one hard and he hit it straight. 
Who do you think is happier, Bill Cower or Chris Brown? Seven to three, Patriots lead. With Troy Brown in motion, Brady will throw. That's complete, and this is Brown. And Brown across the 40 and out to the 42 or 43 yard line. Duh. Brady eludes the tackler. No, he goes down at the 47. Jason Gilden kept after him and got it. Another play the blitz. Stewart on the run. Brought down across the 15 to the 17 yard line. Willie McGinnis need a first down here on third and nine. Here comes the blitz. Picked up well. The pass wide open in the middle of the field is Troy Brown. Inside the 45 to the 40 yard line and a first down. Well, the Patriots guessed right. They left everybody in to protect. You can see Tom Brady on the ground. Now, Bledsoe throw complete at the 25-yard line to David Patton. Bledsoe on the move now. Heading for the sideline and is whacked out of bounds by Chad Scott. Bledsoe throws this side. That's complete to Patton, and Patton is out of bounds at about the 11. Bledsoe throwing. Corner of the end zone. Touchdown! <laughs> Celebrations in the Patriots executive box. Celebrations around Drew Bledsoe on the field. Unbelievable. They put all three wide receivers to the right. They keep the tight end. They block it all. The Steelers blitz. Troy Brown against Jason Gilden. There's no way. I'm sorry. It was David Patton on the catch. Another good play by Bledsoe. Vinatieri's kick is good. David Patton has not caught a pass all day from Tom Brady. He just caught three, including a touchdown pass from Drew Bledsoe. 14-3 pass. Patriot defenders all falling back, and Stewart launches it downfield. Intercepted at the five. Terrell Buckley went up, grabbed the football, cut off any chance of the Steelers putting points on the board, and take a look at the scoreboard at halftime. The New England Patriots have come in here, put 14 on the board, one on a special teams return. They lead it 14 to three, and we go down to our... Stewart on a draw. To the 17th. Stewart. Throw. Incomplete and almost intercepted by Willie McGinnis. Other end of the field earlier. That was blocked. Rolling. Picked up by Troy Brown. Troy, no, it's number 23. And that's Antoine Harris. And Antoine Harris has taken it to the end zone for a touchdown. Troy Brown picked it up and laddles it to Harris. What a play by and, Troy Brown. And another special teams touchdown for the New England Patriots. Here's the kick. We think Brandon Mitchell, 96, comes through, knocks it down. And Troy Brown, nothing to lose, goes for the pickup. Nice pickup, and then gets rid of it. Antoine Harris, a second-year defensive back out of Virginia. 49. The kick is up, and the kick is good. 8.51 to play in the third quarter. The Patriots extend their lead to 21-3. Problems continue. Stewart, with plenty of time, throws, and that is... Complete inside the 45-yard line. Nice grab by Heinz Ward. Stewart with a little pop over the middle to Zeroway. Zeroway inside the 30, inside the 25, and out of bounds. First down, Pittsburgh. Comes the blitz. Stewart throws far side, and that one is complete to Ward. And Ward run out of bounds by Ty Law. A little extra over there. Gets him a penalty play. Come on, come on. Pitch for Zeroway, trying to turn the corner inside the five, diving for the end zone. Did he get there? No. Straight ahead, Bettis looking for the end zone. 
No touchdown call yet, and now it is. Pittsburgh Steelers took advantage of the penalties. And the bus keeps on rolling. Season finale. Chris Brown's extra point attempt is good. And a little further. Jerome Bettis back on the field, back in the end zone. 21-10, Patriots. Bledsoe goes down at the 21. On second and 10. To the near side, and that's Kreider out of the backfield, and Kreider belted out of bounds by Ty Law. Stewart throws wide open inside the 15 yard line is Burris. Burris still on his feet and now out of bounds. And penalty markers are down. Zero in. Zero in. up the middle. Touchdown! the Patriots defense guessing Teddy Bruschi just gets devoured by Marvell Smith on the inside and Amos Airway has that little extra speed to make it work Chris Brown's extra point attempt is good the Pittsburgh Steelers rejoice 129 to play in the third the Patriots lead is down to four Let's so throws and on the end cut. That's complete. The AFC Championship has 15 minutes to decide a winner. That's the end of the third. New England leads at 21-17. We're coming back after this message and a word from your local station. You're watching the NFL on CBS. Gets rid of it. Complete to Edwards out of the backfield for a first down to the Bledsoe. The side. And it is got it away long enough, straight enough, and it's good. Adam Vinatieri, another clutch field goal. 24-17, New England. Stewart to throw on second and 10. Burris, and Burris just short of the 50-yard line. Stewart, far side of the field. And that one is complete to Hines Ward. And here it comes, here just it comes. as you say that. Stewart down the sideline. It is incomplete, intended. Let's so with time. Lofts it out, and it's complete to Troy Brown and out of bounds for a first down. Let's so throws over the middle. Incomplete. Intended for Patton. <laughs> Looking for the draw, and it's not there. He may have lost a yard on the play. Plenty of time for Stewart. Throws over the middle, bounced up into the air and intercepted. To Bucky Jones, has the football inside the 40, inside the 35-yard line. You're the quarterback. He looks to the outside. It's Hines Ward. He leads him too much, and to Bucky Jones makes a nice interception. Third turnover of the day by the Pittsburgh Steelers. Jones with one interception during the regular season and Corbin. Same play they scored a touchdown on. Bledsoe steps up, throws to the far sideline. Nobody there. Incomplete. On the way. Long enough, but why? The pass over the middle, and that one's intercepted. This is Lawyer Malloy, and Malloy is down at midfield. 